Hello and welcome back to the history of. Today we embark on a fascinating journey through time to explore the rise and fall of one of the most powerful and enduring empires in history, the Ottoman Empire. From its humble beginnings to its eventual decline, this empire has left an indelible mark on the world. So grab your virtual passports as we delve into the rich tapestry of the Ottoman Empire's history. Let's rewind the clock to early 14th century. The Ottoman Empire was founded by Osman I, a charismatic leader who united various Turkish tribes in Anatolia. Over the next several centuries, the Ottomans would expand their territories through military conquest, strategic alliances, and skilled leadership. By the 15th century, under the rule of Mehmed II, the Ottoman Empire reached its zenith with the capture of Constantinople in 1453, signaling the end of the Byzantine Empire. The 16th and 17th century marked the Ottoman Empire's golden age, characterized by economic prosperity, cultural flourishing, and military dominance. Suleiman the Magnificent, one of the most famous Ottoman rulers presided over this period of expansion and grandeur. The Ottomans controlled key trade routes, fostering a diverse and vibrant cultural exchange in their cosmopolitan capital, Istanbul. The Ottoman Empire's golden age wasn't just marked by military triumphs, but also by a flourishing of culture and the creation of breathtaking architectural marvels. The Ottomans were patrons of arts, supporting poets, scholars, and artists, leading to a rich cultural tapestry. The grandeur of Ottoman architecture is epitomized by structures like the Blue Mosque and the Hagia Sophia, which blended Islamic and Byzantine influences. The empire's commitment to the arts left an enduring legacy that continues to captivate the world today. The Ottoman Empire was a melting pot of different cultures, religions and ethnicities. Despite being an Islamic state, it practiced a policy of religious tolerance, allowing various religious communities to coexist within its borders. This diversity contributed to vibrant cultural exchange, with influences from Arabic, Persian and European traditions. The Ottoman court itself was a hub of intellectual and artistic activity, with poets like Rumi and architects like Sinan leaving an indelible mark on the cultural landscape. At the heart of the Ottoman military machine were the Janissaries, an elite force composed of slave soldiers who were recruited from conquered territories. These highly disciplined and loyal troops played a crucial role in the empire's military success. The Ottoman military was also known for its strategic innovation, including the use of gunpowder and a formidable navy. The Ottoman navy, led by skilled admirals like Barbarossa, dominated the Mediterranean and secured key maritime routes, enhancing the empire's economic power. Despite early military successes, the Ottoman military faced challenges as it entered the 17th century. Technological advancements in Europe surpassed Ottoman capabilities, and the once invincible Janissaries became a source of internal strife. The empire's military decline was exacerbated by a lack of modernization and adaptation to changing warfare techniques, contributing to its vulnerabilities in later years. In 
In response to the challenges of the 19th century, the Ottoman Empire initiated the Tanzimat reforms, a series of political, legal, and administrative changes aimed at modernizing the state. These reforms, which began in the mid-19th century, sought to introduce a more equitable legal system, enhance education, and improve infrastructure. While the Tanzimat reforms aimed to revitalize the empire, their implementation faced resistance from the conservative elements within the Ottoman society. Despite the best intentions, the Tanzimat reforms struggled to keep pace with the rapid changing geopolitical landscape. The empire's attempts at modernizing were further hampered by external pressures from European powers who sought to influence and exploit the weakening Ottoman state. The complex interplay of internal resistance, external interference, and the sheer magnitude of the reforms led to mixed results, highlighting the immense challenges the Ottoman Empire faced in its quest for modernity. However, no empire is without its challenges. As the Ottomans entered the 18th century, they faced internal strife, economic difficulties, and military setbacks. The once mighty empire began to show signs of decline. External pressures, including conflicts with European powers and territorial losses, further weakened the Ottoman state. The Tanzimat reforms in the mid-19th century attempted to modernize the empire, but the pace of change struggled to keep up with the challenges. As the 20th century dawned, the Ottoman Empire found itself on the wrong side of history during World War I. The empire sided with central powers, ultimately leading to its dismemberment. The Treaty of Servida in 1920 marked a significant blow to the Ottoman Empire, reducing its territory and influence. However, Mustafa Kemal Ataturk emerged as a pivotal figure in Turkish history, leading a successful war of independence and establishing the Republic of Turkey in 1923, officially bringing an end to the Ottoman Empire. As we conclude our exploration of the Ottoman Empire, We've witnessed a remarkable journey from its humble beginnings to its grandeur and eventual decline. The Ottoman Empire's impact on history is undeniable and its legacy lives on in the modern state of Turkey and the echoes of its cultural, military and political achievements. If you found this historical journey intriguing, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Until our next adventure through time, this is MJ signing off. Stay curious.